Okay, um, next question. Two months ago, my partner and I went our separate ways. For a long time, I knew we wanted different things from a relationship. And when I realized, when I finally st started my personal growth work, I outgrew what we had together. I now realize that I'm only interested in being in, with someone who wants similar things in a relationship so that we can belong to a shared vision. My question is, how soon is too soon to be open to meeting such a person? Part of me feels excited with my new revelation and wants to go out and put it into practice straight away. Another part feels guilty for not being up, more upset that I am, than I am. Looking back, I think grieving the loss of this relationship gradually over a period of years while we were still together. So the breakup itself was sad, but not severe. Any thoughts uh, from you on the timeline of meeting someone new would be greatly appreciated. This is a fantastic question. Thank you for asking this question. And this is something that actually a lot of INF types uh, do. Because we do tend to live in our emotions. And so even when we are in relationships, uh, we can move on from one relationship to another quite quickly once that old relationship. We've already, you know, a lot of the time we've already uh, grieved the ending of the relationship before we're able to take the, the steps to actually end the relationship or before the relationship ends. So it is not unusual for INF types to have this um, sense of, you know, just moving on quite quickly after a relationship ends. Please don't feel uh, guilty about not feeling worse. Uh, relationships are hard enough. And if you think about how long you may have grieved already while you were in the relationship, perhaps, you know, there's, there's nothing more left to grieve for you. Um, so, yeah, I really really recommend that uh, you look at the your whole your experience as a whole rather than this is how it should be or this is how it should be it is exactly the way that it is and that's fine so don't like look at where that guilt might be coming from is it coming from you know uh, modeled behavior maybe something you were taught as a child is it uh, societal uh, what is really giving you that sense of um, oh I should okay I think we're back uh, so my point was that you know, look at yourself as a whole. Don't look at this is how I should be. This is how everything should be. Instead, kind of look at it. Okay, so what has been my experience about this relationship already throughout all of these years? Because you might actually find that, that, you know, you are actually ready to move on into something that is more... Um, more um, suitable for you. Now, if you feel a sense of, I should move on already, I should already move on to something else, that's not a great sign. That is, again, yourself shooting yourself into, into being something or, you know, being in a certain way, which may or may not actually be relevant to you. So whenever you catch yourself saying, I should do this or I shouldn't do that, you're usually probably not going to make a Make a decision that's based on an authentic life experience. So try and stay as authentic to yourself as possible. Relationships are messy. That's just the nature of relationships. And you don't always know how something's going to go until you play it out, until you allow yourself to just go, hey, hang on a second, I'm just going to try this and see what happens. And sometimes it's going to go south and then I'm going to deal with that. Now, if you are in, really interested in, in getting those, um, those relational um, pieces together really nicely, I recommend that you look into the four people within work. And in our Facebook groups, you will find in the unit section a, an outline of the INFJ and INFP um, 
four people within round table model and you go in there and start doing that work and if you feel attracted to it then go over to mariasumilov.com and grab the full ebook which is uh, i think like 35 pages long study through that and then if that still feels like yeah you know what i want to integrate myself this way then check out the the full four people within course the home study course um, i really recommend that because the more integrated we are as the people that we are the more likely we are to actually have really good relationships so i hope that helps let me know if you have further questions if you want to continue that conversation more if you're not if you're still not sure what to do just get in touch with us desk at maria or sorry desk at infxproject.com and uh, we'll have one of the um, our integration mentors to to have a chat with you